See, the question is, A is twice as efficient as B. A and B work together to complete a work in seven days. In how many days can A alone complete the work? In how many days can A alone complete the work is the question. So, this is a work on time. This is a quantity applied question on time and work. This is a quantity applied question on time and work. So, what happens is, A can do a work in uh, we do not know that is what is being asked and uh, A is twice efficient as B now uh, when we talk about time and work always convert it as work done in a single unit work done in a single unit if days are given convert how much you can do in one work one day if it is minutes are given find out what you can do in one minute if hours are given convert what you can do in one hour like that always convert as work done in a single unit no, because your days are given, you have to find out what each one can do in one day. Now, A is twice efficient than B means, if A is doing two pens, if A is doing two pens in one day, if A is doing two pens in one day, B will do one pen in one day. B will do one pen in one day. So, this is the efficiency. A is as twice as efficient means, A is doing two pens in one day, B will do one pen in one day. B will do one pen in one day. I can also write like this. If B is doing one pen in one day, or I will make it as one pen in two days. If B is doing one pen in two days, then A for doing the same pen, one pen, he will be taking only one day. So it can be done like this also. This is output wise in one day. If he does two pens, he does one, one pen. Whereas day wise, for doing the same activity, B will take two days, whereas A will take one day. So, day wise, A is taking lesser number of days. Output wise, A is doing more number of work for the same period. So, we are always converting as, I also told you, convert it as single unit. So, single unit and day wise, what happens is, day wise, B is taking two days, A is doing one, one day for the same work. So, according to this, B will be equal to 2A. Day wise. This is day wise. Day wise. B will be equal to 2A. Output wise, A will be equal to 2B. Don't get confused because I have seen many of you getting confused here. So, B will be equal to 2A day wise. B will be equal to 2A day wise. What I have asked is, A can complete in how many days? Now, work done concept always started as work done in one unit. So, one by A and what they complete the work in seven days in one day A will do one by A. In one day A will do one by A. In one day B will do one by B. This A is the number of days A will complete the work. B is the number of days B will complete the work. So in one day they will do one by A. In one day he will do one by B. And they combine to do such so one by A plus one by B. They are able to do it in seven days in one day they will do one by seven. Now instead of B make it as two A. Instead of B make it as two A. So 1 by A plus 1 by 2A will be equal to 1 by 7. So the LCM is 2A. The LCM is 2A. So 2 plus 1 will be equal to 1 by 7. So 21 will be equal to 2A. A will be equal to 10.5. The answer is 10.5 days. A will do the work in 10.5 days. And B will be taking 21 days. A will be doing the work in 10.5 days. B will be doing it in 21 days. Subscribe to my channel. I will be adding questions every now and then. Wish you all the best.